Tony did black on the top because it gives that bear look. <laughs> no matter how much he says he's not a bear, we all know. <laughs> My name is Shell, also known as Shellinin, and this is Game Glow, a show where you can follow along and learn makeup looks based off your favorite games and characters. And as you can see, today you're going to be following along with my look for Monokuma from Danganronpa. So Danganronpa is one of my favorite game series. I had a lot of fun playing it. Today is the day. <laughs> So let's get started. I'm going to go ahead and start with my eyes first and I'm going to start with this side. I'm going to take my MAC paint stick in the color pure white on that eyelid. It's really thick so when you're doing something small like your eye, you have to be careful. Like I said, this is pretty thick so you have to be careful. So I'm going to go over this with a white eyeshadow. And yep, that's my white eyeshadow. Let's move on to the next step. So now I'm going to go ahead and take my MAC liquid eyeliner and just do a basic cat eye over this white eyeshadow. And just sharpen it up in the edges here. It's likely that I'll do lashes, so I'll do white mascara. Gotta be super careful because I don't want to get it on my actual skin. But yeah, this is actually working. Okay, next for my other eye, I'm going to take this red eyeliner here and draw the shape of Monokuma's eye under my eyelid. Start at the really tippy corner of my eye and bring it downward and connect them. I just keep looking over for reference. I'm going to take this MAC Pro Eye Palette and take an eyeshadow brush and choose this red here and just fill in the bottom. Yeah, this is a really good everyday red. Very bright, vibrant. But for what we're doing today, I'm thinking I want like, even redder. <laughs> I'm gonna just take this red paint stick. It's called Basic Red. And I'm gonna take my eyeshadow brush and pick up the pigment from it. Yes, that is a lot more pigment that I'm looking for. Now that the bottom lid is done, I'm gonna go on the top lid with this red here. I'm gonna take this black eyeshadow right here and just apply it on top. So it's super dramatic while the other side is like chill, which is pretty Monokuma. Yeah, this is what I was going for. And then I'm gonna grab my MAC liquid eyeliner again and do like another cat eye. Okay. Okay, now I'm gonna take the red paint stick again and just like do the bottom lid. Now that I am done with my eyeshadow, I'm gonna go into my brows and just shape them up. That's it for my eyebrows. Even though I'm gonna do eyelashes after, I still wanna apply mascara. This is the In Extreme Dimension Waterproof Lash and it's in the color Dimensional Black. Yeah, I like that a lot. <laughs> I want to start doing lips, so I actually had some MAC black lipstick in my makeup collection already. So it's in the color In The Spirit. It's matte and it's just black as you can see. Just apply it to my top lip. Now for my bottom lip, I'm going to take this brown liquid lipstick that I usually use for my nude lips and apply it to the bottom. I only did black on the top because it gives that bear look. <laughs> no matter how much he says he's not a bear, we all know. <laughs> I'm going to start applying blush and I'm going to get this MAC powder blush in the color Frankly Scarlet and apply that to my cheeks. This is a really cute blush. I like this a lot. I always like to smile when I'm applying blush because it helps me see my cheeks. And now I'm going to take this red lip tint here and like I said, apply it towards the center. I want to add some highlight. So I'm going to take this highlighter stick and I'm going to apply it to the bridge of my nose as well as my cheekbones. Those are just like staples to me. <laughs> as well as the blush at the same time. Yes. And now finish the look, I'm gonna use Max Prep and Prime Fix Matte and Spray. I actually like this a lot because most setting sprays drown me and I feel like this is like a lot lighter. <laughs> and yeah, that's the look. I'm gonna just go ahead and apply lashes and nails and I'll be right back. 
So I decided to go with some super dramatic eyelashes and some press on nails to match the split look. Big thank you to Mac for sending me all these goodies for today's makeup look. If you want to recreate this look at home or recreate a similar look with the same tools I use, be sure to check the link in the description. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for tuning in. Bye everyone.